Hi friends. Today we learn about non-aqueous acid base titrations. So what is non-aqueous base titrations? Most of the titrations are performed in the aqueous medium. Means water is used as a solvent. There may be a difficulty if reactant in insoluble in water or reactant is a reactive with the water or the analyte is either too weak acid or too weak base those too weak acids or bases cannot be titrated in aqueous solution due to the amphoteric behavior of the water that is water can act as a acid or water can act as a base so water will compete with the sample if it is a weak acid or weak base the simple solution for this problem is to replace water as a solvent with another non aqueous solvent so this type of titration is named as non aqueous titrations non aqueous acid base titrations is performed to eliminate two problems encountered during the aqueous titration of the weakly acidic or weakly basic analyte by a strong acid or strong base titrant respectively these two two problems are one poor solubility and second is exceedingly weak reactivity in an aqueous medium thus non aqueous titration is the titration of a substance dissolved in a non aqueous solvent it is the most common titrimetic procedure used in a pharmacopoeial acid the moisture content in a non aqueous titration should not be more than 0.05% concent and hall first and foremost reported the wonderful investigations of the intricate behavior pattern of a basis in glacial acetic acid now let's learn about the principle behind non aqueous acid base titrations bronsted lowry theory is used in non aqueous titration according to this theory an acid is a proton donor that is a substance which tends to dissociate to yield a proton and a base is a proton acceptor that is a substance which tends to combine with the proton when an acid h b dissociates it is a proton together with the conjugate base p of the acid alternatively the base b will combine with the proton to yield the conjugate acid hp of the base b for every base its conjugate acid and every acid has its conjugate base advantages of non aqueous titrations titration of water insoluble drugs but soluble in non aqueous solvents can be determined by non aqueous titrations titration of weakly acidic and basic drugs gives poor end points in aqueous titrations but in non aqueous titration they give sharp end point non aqueous titration methods can be used for titration of water sensitive drugs like aspirins and chlorofricol due to wider pH range as compared to water a non aqueous titration can be carried out on two or more acids in mixture non aqueous titrations are simple fast precise and accurate by the proper choice of a solvents or indicators the biological ingredients of a substance whether acidic or basic can be selectively analyzed so these are all the advantages of non aqueous acid base titrations still in non aqueous method titration there are some drawbacks like in this titration temperature moisture and carbon dioxide should be controlled properly solvent is in non aqueous titration are expensive again solvents used in non aqueous titration sometimes are volatile some solvents are hazardous if they mishandled such as ammonia it can be fatal if it inhale more it is not an environment friendly method 
solvents may pollute the environment. So these are all the drawbacks of the non-acid, non-aqueous acid-based titrations.